Hello. If you want your audience should listen to you. If you want to improve your voice quality, if you want to work on your voice, the natural voice, if you want to be the magnet on stage just by your voice, then this video is for you. Watch it till the last because I will be telling few tips which I use to improve my voice quality. Hi, my name is Giri Sharma and I welcome you to my YouTube channel. So without any further delay, let's get to the point. Voice quality is very, very important. Even if you're working in an office where you have to give the presentation uh, to your juniors, even if you are a student where you have to give your presentations or maybe you are anchoring at your school, college or in general also your voice quality is very very important. So we have to first accept it that I cannot have the voice like Mr. Amitabh Bachchan hey, or uh, Mr. Shatrugan Sinha. Okay, so everyone have a certain range of their voice. They can walk on that particular range only but in that particular range only they can sharp their voice and they can make it more natural more classy and more uh, there is a hindi word called karna priyat which is like we want to listen it always and always so these are the tips which you should use to improve your voice quality the tip number one this is very very important is whenever you wake up early in the morning the first thing which you have to do is humming like this I can give you the example like uh, you are listening an aeroplane Because at morning your these vocal cords are very soft so if you will do the humming exercise it will work on the base of your voice whenever you are speaking with the base it will look good and uh, the texture of your voice will improve so the humming in the morning is very very important the second thing for your voice quality is even if you are a singer and if you are not a singer you should understand that there is the level of the voices which we use for example now i'm talking from the base of my voice and now i'm talking at the above level of the voice and now i'm talking at the highest level of my voice so you need to understand that these are the level of the voices which we use in our anchoring or the communication skills so how you will understand these level of the voices because it comes into this sargam from start to end so even if you are a singer and if you are not a singer you need to do the practice of this sargam every day at any time at daytime if you are getting you know the time uh, you, when you are in train bus when you are um, traveling to your event shows so if you do the practice of the circum it you will understand okay this is the level i'm talking this is the level i'm talking and this is the level i'm talking and you can change your the level of the voice as per the requirement of the event because whenever there is an excitement then you have to speak at the upper level of your voice so that it looks like that you are very very excited for the show for the event for the achievement and when there is something emotional which you have to speak then of course it has to be at the lower level of your voice so how you will understand is all by sargam so you have to do the practice of the sargam every day whenever you get time so how to do this practice of the sargam you can google on uh, youtube about this sargam from where you can get these basic lessons of singing Sa -re -ga -ma -pa -dha -ni -sa -sa -ni -dha -pa Re 
did you notice it is from the lower level to the higher level singers no uh, you know knows it very very well but for the uh, normal people who are into the field of communication who has to do the conversation with the audience it is very very important that you should understand the level of your voices uh, what is the range of your voice and you have to do the practice every day the third thing is the voice modulation where you have to uh, how you have to mold your voice for example now i'm speaking without any sort of the voice modulation i don't know where i have to mold my voice and i'm speaking like a normal person like a normal person talking to somebody and there is no modulation into the, my voice and now i'm talking to you with voice modulation so you understood the difference of voice modulation because this is the time i'm not speaking with any sort of the modulation and then i don't know how to do module my voice so the voice modulation is very very important for any sort of conversation for any sort of presentation and the anchoring as well so how you can learn the voice modulation there is only one solution for the voice modulation read loudly so for example if you have any book or uh, of any language or any uh, b b newspaper any magazine you are reading so not in front of everybody because otherwise people will make fun of you <laughs> like uh, you know i i used to do it my in uh, at airport and all and everybody is looking at me oh my god look at this boy so whenever you are not with someone of course uh, you have to improve so you have to work on this so then read this complete book loudly uh, so uh, for example like we do into the theater then slowly slowly your subconscious mind will understand okay here i have to uh, mold my voice here i have to take the pause and here i have to start speaking again so reading loudly reading loudly is very very important for the voice texture and the voice modulation so i have told you the three tips the first is humming in the morning second is doing the riyaz of the saregama pa dha ni sa and the third thing is reading loudly uh, any literature which you want to read and the fourth and the most important thing about improving your voice quality is listen listen to your voice so nowadays by the blessing of god we have a huge technology like on mobile or anywhere you can record your voice and then you should listen yourself uh, how is your voice where you are lacking uh, are you too fast because i tell you that even if you would find my initial videos also i'm always very fast on stage and all i used to be now i have worked a lot on this so uh, but i was not aware that i'm talking so fast on stage or uh, anywhere even in my day to day conversation as well but when i recorded my voice and uh, i started listening it i realized no i'm very fast so make sure that you record your voice and listen it the voice quality is very very important you can attract your audience you can become like a magnet if you work on your voice quality do work on these steps and let me know how do you find it well with this this is your host and this girish sign up get by take care thank you for watching my video how did you like it good bad even it if it is bad also do write in the comment section and yes do subscribe my video bye